So, here we have what I would like to call a blank canvas ready for the tattoo. So, um, if I take that link file up to there, up to the top again, so that we can see the tattoo. Now, um, I first of all need to put in the background colour of the tattoo. So that's what I'm going to do. So I'll just hide it for now. Um, the way I did the background colour is exactly the same way as I did the shadows and the light. So if I just put them in. that one and what I've done is I've put the light basically on, on there over the top of the background colour uh, because the opacity is um, 44 on that and uh, it can show a bit of the uh, background of the background colour through the light um, and the next thing of course is the detail so I'll show that linked file again and magnify that up just to get a close look at the detail there. So, pen tool, what I'm going to do is go round with the pen tool this piece of detail here. So, there we have, we have a closed path there. Now, um, I'm going to do the middle piece with my paintbrush. So, but first of all, what I want to do is get the colour as close as I can. So with the colour picker here, I'm going to get uh, go on to the darker green there. And then what I'm going to do is put it into the um, swatch palette. So I'm going to call it Tattoo 1. So play there, and you'll see there it's appeared into the swatch panel. And I'll get my paintbrush. And what I want to do is just There. and then come down here and again down to there so now I want to make and get another colour out of the tattoo so I'm going to take the lighter green there I'm going to call that doesn't look too good do that again one, two, three, in there. That's better. I'm going to call that tattoo two. Okay, that. And you will see that's gone into the swatch colour there, that blue there that I put in accidentally has gone in by the there. Um, 
so if I go on to there click in and put it in a little green path uh, fill and then on green path and there we are if I put that one to normal size take out the link path and there you see just one part of the detail and basically it's the painstaking you you can make this tattoo as detailed or not detailed as as ever you want whichever we whichever looks good um so what i'm going to do is i'm going to take out take away these paths dump them as usual And, yeah. and I'm going to put the tattoo detail in that I've already got. Put that down. And there. Back up, and then we've got some more here. And there we have the tattoo. Now, just as some finishing touches, uh, we've got Burning Lotus, and I've made that so that uh, it's it's in ordinary font, but I've enlarged those two letters just to go into a kind of a post that she's leaning on. Uh, put a drop shadow of red on the burning, and a drop shadow of green on the lotus. And then uh, a grey rectangle so that the whole thing looks embossed. And then sign it, why not? And there we are. Finished article, Burning Lotus. A beautiful tattoo. Well, all that's left for me to say is uh, thanks very much for watching. Anything you need to know, just leave me some questions in the comments down below, and uh, I'll keep an eye on the comments and try and get back to you. Thank you. Bye.